Atukumi maa serekali na mwono maende ya kubiki ya kuidhwa maiteta. Na kila kiyo kubiki ya kuidhwa kituma mwoma teta na udhukumi wa serekali na ndebisio na mauti imu wa maandevi. Ma hibiki ya kuidhwa mayasi ya serekali ni alito wabiki ya kuidhwa imadhini kiana kwa maitha kwanzi ya ilasi ya ilite na mauti yo mwoma misahala. Ni maileto wabiki ya kuidhwa maidhini kiwa. Katika te wala mabiki ya kuidhwa mainena ni mabiki ya kuidhwa mayasi ya. Ni maikito udhukumi. Ndini wa serekali ilena wabiki ya kuidhwa iwe toka na serekali ilajibo. Serekali ilajibo ni yende na wabiki ya kuidhwa yosa ni wosa ni wakoti. Na vaina kiwa dhuka ni ukinene cha wosa ni wakoti. Katika te uo na alama na wabiki ya kuidhwa maiti ya wea. Hindi ndibisi honi siwi wiketo wabiki ya kuidhwa ima dhongota. Nundu ainge ni wiketo wabiki ya kuidhwa maiselegu wa mesala. Balayu ni wabiki ya kuidhwa mayumi ya muamulo mayasi ya kanamu. Kedhi wa serekali ino yubikia kuidhwa ikinyete na itambia juu ya manenga mbaka mwaini wa muonza Nivu makabikia kuidhwa mayamu wa matambia ala makabikia kuidhwa mayosa Kedhi wa misala yo hika iwa ibindani ila ya ilete Mauti yo ma misala yo maika vikia kuidhwa mayiki wavo matonyo vikia kuidhwa mayosa nziengi Ya utuwa isi ya mkomo ndi yonde When you look at the revenue collection in this country The way Uru left we have not realized any decrease in revenue collection in this country. The government of William Ruto does not have reason at all to delay payment of workers in this country. What I know as a member of parliament in this country, the problem with this government, Ruto and his team managed to be in the leadership of this country and they were not prepared to lead this country. So allocation of resources is a big challenge to the administration of Ruto. That's why we are suffering in this country. These people are on looting spree. And if we don't stop them, I can tell you this country is going to stall. When you look at what's happening currently, the revenue we are collecting in this country is positioned in areas which are easy to eat. That's why the workers cannot get their pay. But as a trade unionist, I want to pass this message very clear to the government. Come July, if there is no plan to improve allowances and salaries of workers in this country, let them prepare for mega strikes. We are not going to work in this country as maids. We are paid the way they think. We must demand for our pay and money be allocated commensurate to the work we are doing in this country. Now you talk about university professors. Today we are burying a professor and his friend is testifying here that he died empty. Why? Because of poor payment and poor pension and poor medical scheme in retirement. We want people who have sacrificed their lives in this country and work for people of Kenya. When you retire, you retire with dignity. You go home in a place where you can afford your own medication. Most retirees are suffering in this country because when you retire, it's like you are abandoned. During the time you are working, they milked you. When you leave the service, these people shouldn't swap. But when you retire, you get a medical scheme which can keep you in that retirement. But if that one is not there, then come July, we as leaders of workers in this country, we must unite and say one thing. The retirees of this country must be respected. And the only respect we can give people who have retired is good medical cover, and pencil which can make